Let the garbage truck go by. Again, neighbors are very neighborly. It does have somewhat of a formal entry with a pillar. It's a bunch of heather growing. Into the three car garage. I just want to show you there's a utility sink as well as extra storage. And there's a door that goes out to the yard that I'll show you. Lots of storage and cabinets. Brick, traditional brick. A Japanese maple right outside the office. And here, if I get out of the sun, you can see they're cute with the shutters and a somewhat formal entry. Trees for privacy. Okay, sorry, I don't want to get you dizzy here. Pull out screen door. Okay. I'm going to stop this. And st okay, here we go. Tile floors. Let's look up. Tall ceilings. There, that is hand blown glass, kind of contemporary lights hanging there, but you could have a, a place to hang your hat. And. Another coat closet right here. Whoa, a little narrow. Broom closet, I should say. Okay, so we have tile and a kind of nice entryway, but you do walk in and there you see the sweeping ceilings and two skylights. To the left is the saloon doors to the utility room. Okay. I'm not sure if the washer and dryer are going, but they have a nice washer and dryer. <sighs> lots of places for, you know, lots of cabinets and counter space. Um, do they have a sink over here? No. Okay. Okay. So, back to the entry. To the left is the hallway with the bedrooms. Again, very high ceilings. Lots of wall space for your antiques. And this is the kitchen to the right that also has a pocket door. So if you wanted to have some separation from the great room to the kitchen. Okay, I'm going to stop.